Hey, what's going on guys? Oink here. Today we're going into the International Bee Coffee Break Challenge and the first one that we're going to be looking at is the Eco Challenge 2. So the first one of these was at Nürburgring. You had to see how far you could get with the limited fuel. In this one, we're in the CRZ at Suzuka and in fact, we've got to do an entire lap and it's time-based. So instead of seeing how far you can go, it's seeing how fast you can get around the track without running out of fuel. So you've got to complete the whole lap, obviously. You can't run out of fuel. And to get gold, you've got to do that lap in 3 minutes and 10 seconds or under. Now, straight off the bat, I shifted straight up into 6th gear. You want to keep your revs as low as possible. The more revs you have, the more fuel you're going to use, basically. So it's a combination of keeping your revs as low as possible, keeping it as smooth as possible and not, you know, wasting all of the energy that you've created. So if you, you know, accelerate really fast into a corner and then have to slam on the brakes again and then you have to accelerate back out, then obviously that's a lot of wasted uh, fuel. So you want to try and keep a good average speed and then you'll be using as little uh, additional fuel to maintain that speed as possible. So. Wherever possible, try not to use the brakes and try and just sustain your speed with uh, use of the accelerator or, you know, not use of the accelerator, so coming off the accelerator and letting the car roll. As we come up then, so I kind of stuck it in around 4th and 5th coming through the S's, uh, and as we come to the top of the hill there, I'm shifting up into 5th, and this was actually, I think, like my first or second try. I think I came off on turn 1 on my first try, so this is kind of my first real try at the whole track, so I really was just going in blind uh, to this one. Um, so I'm sure it could be done a little bit better than what I did here. It wasn't, you know, by any means a perfect run, but it got the job done. So I wouldn't worry too much if it's not, you know, absolutely bang on, because uh, I had a bit of breathing space at the end of this lap, which you guys will see once we get to the end of the video. Anyway, getting to this hairpin, I was at almost exactly half fuel and 1 minute 38. So coming around the hairpin, 1 minute 38 and almost bang on uh, half a litre left in the tank. And just, uh, again, shifting around the sort of four to 5,000 rev mark, as you can see there, maybe 4,500 shifting up into 5th. Uh, and then I think, again, maybe we'll go up into 6th as we come into this. We'll see. Can't remember. Anyway, as I said, you want to be using minimal brakes. You can see just kind of 25-50% brake, then coming off, letting the car smoothly into the corner. Um, went down to 3rd here, probably didn't need to, because uh, I had a bit of spare kind of uh, exit there. As you can see, car wasn't as fast as it could have been through that corner so we didn't really need to uh, go down to third there but when we get back onto the straight I'm at around 85 miles and shift into sixth and just full throttle uh, with the low revs and that really makes a pretty good use of the fuel down this straight. Uh, you can pretty much take this corner at full throttle I think as long as you get the apex right. As you can see there just hitting the apex staying it in sixth Keep it in within the lines, of course. If you run off the track, that will disqualify you. And then we do actually go uh, a bit of braking here, come down to third. Watch out, because ABS is disabled for this, so you don't want to slam the brakes on too hard, otherwise you may lock it up. And then I realised that I haven't got too long left and still plenty of fuel, so I just rev it all the way up, keep it in third, uh, and really burn through that fuel to get a nice acceleration out of that slow corner. Finish with a 3 minutes 4.594 and I think 0.4 litres left in the tank. So that's the uh, Eco Challenge number 2. Hope this video helped you out guys and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.